Hey guys, it's me, your best friend Joe. Welcome back to Alice Madness Returns. This is part two of my Let's Play. We're back here with Alice and um, my video game doppelganger here, the Duchess. <laughs> it's sad because it's true. Okay, in the last episode we got the Pepper Grinder, which shoots stuff, as you can see. You have a, a limited amount of ammo in the upper right-hand corner, and when it... it it has to, like, regenerate every once in a while. So we have to go shoot some piggy snouts, if I remember the goal of this. Oh, and you guys, this was, like, an overwhelmingly positive playthrough, too. This, it was, like, crazy how- oh, shit, okay. I, hold on, hold on. Like, I, I didn't know what you guys were gonna think of this game, but you guys, like, fucking loved it. I was, like, all about it. You guys were all about it. Yeah! <laughs> I guess it's obvious that I love this game, so I I guess I was just excited that you guys liked it too. Where- okay. The bees come out of this thing. Wasps, whatever. So, let's just kill them all. Oh, okay. I can focus on them. I should probably have done that ages ago. Alright, regenerate please. Gorgeous. What are those? They look like big dung balls. Is that it? Is everybody dead? Why is there, like, this ominous music playing? There's gotta be another one, right? Oh, sh god damn it. Yeah. For sure. Okay, you chill. Everybody chill. What are these wasps made out of? Oh, they're like nuts and bolts. Screws? Someone make a screw joke in the comments section. <laughs> I, can't, I can't be bothered. I can't do it today. More? More? Where? Okay, I'm gonna kill them all before- oh, you. Ew, gross! Okay, excuse me. It's extra creepy because they have, like, the child's heads. Which I guess is the purpose, is for them to be creepy. Alright, for every domain, keep an ear out for snouts. So I need to turn up my volume. Sorry, I just smacked you guys. Uh, something I wish I could do sometimes. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Aiming mode and shoot the snout with the pepper grinder. Sometimes you give your little BFFs a smack, you know. Once the snout is full of pepper, it will reveal paths and collectibles. Y'all know what I'm saying. A little love, sm love smack. Love tap. Right? Yes, I wish this whole thing would just... Well, obviously, clearly I need some of this on-screen instruction occasionally, so maybe that's not such a bad thing. Okay, let's collect some teeth. So I can upgrade some stuff at some point. Gorge, gorge. I love how right just then it tells me how to fire the pepper grinder. What? How does it fuck? How the fuck does it think I've been killing all of those fucking screw wasps things? I just don't understand. Oh, also in the in the first game, American McGee's Alice, the one that's this is the sequel to. Did I say that right? Um, there's a lot more references to Wonderland. Someone had a question about that in the comments. And there, I feel like in the first game, there's a lot more, like, references to Wonderland. Whereas this one, I feel like they were just like, let's just do whatever. <laughs> and so sort of anything goes, which you know is Wonderland. Anything can go. Now go away. Oh, wow. So I, get, I got her a pig snout and she just, like, turned me away. What does she even want it for? I guess she's cooking with them. Is that her situation? That looks delish. Oh, I can't jump on them? I like how my first reaction is to just jump on a pile of pig snouts. <laughs> okay, so now the game has taught us a new mechanic. Now we know to shoot piggy snouts. Right? Stunning. Gorgeous. Amazing. I wonder who thought of that concept. Like, oh, we need to, we need a way for her to for Alice to unlock something. I got it. They were just this is just like in the design team in the design room. Let's have her shoot fucking pig snouts. <laughs> oh my god, I didn't see you guys. Oh hi, hi. Sc okay, excuse me, excuse me. I'm gonna have to deal with you guys first. Oh, ow, ow. Okay. Oh, okay. Oh, no. oh, ew, it's on me. Plus left dodge. Okay, okay, okay. Maybe aim. Maybe, okay, okay. Shh. I literally have this so under control, you guys. You're amazed. You're gonna be amazed. Where's, where's the screw thing? Oh, okay. Excuse me. 
Excuse me. Excuse me. There's one over here, right? Can I... Can I, I disable this? Okay. The one thing I don't really like in this game... I don't know if I should have jumped down here yet, but I want to get rid of that. I don't really like the uh, enemy aiming control system. It's just not very... I don't know. Good? <laughs> if I can say that. What, what was the point of that flower? Was there something in here? Oh. Now it's just pretty. Great. Does it do something? Does this have a purpose? If I open... Wait. Wait, you know what? We're just gonna call that something... This, a pretty. Something pretty. Because I don't know what that's supposed to do or what that does. Oh, you know what you might notice in this episode? That my peas... I hope they're not popping. Popping. I'm usually popping. You know, in general. But, um... I'm back home in Ar the gorgeous land of Arkansas, and so I have my pop filter on my microphone, which I left when I went to Seattle, because I didn't know I was going to be staying there for a third of the year. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> so, uh, hopefully my peas aren't popping as much as they were. It was always making me, like, like speak a little bit differently, because I was aware of it. I can also hear myself in my microphone like when I'm recording this which is horrible you have no until you have to hear yourself for like 20 minutes straight like I'm used to hearing myself from like editing videos and stuff but it's not like really live and then I can I can just sort of scrub to the parts where I know I need to edit and just do it really fast but when you have to like hear yourself talk for like okay when you have to hear yourself talk for like 20 minutes straight, this is like torture, right? I don't know how you guys are doing it right now. Props to you. <laughs> oh, I should have gotten those snailies down there. I want those teeth. I hope that becomes like some sort of sound clip. Just me like... All of the weird things I'm gonna say about teeth when I play this game. I want their teeth. <laughs> I'm gonna sound like I have like some sort of teeth fetish. Is that a thing? I know I know about some sorts of fetishes. I am a little versed in oddities. Not I would they're not oddities. We're not gonna shame people with fetishes. I know about you know, some of them are weird. Um yeah. <laughs> you know, there's there's the normal fetishes. Why are we talking about this? Like, um, feet, which, you know, is, has just become so mainstream at this point. It just doesn't phase anybody anymore, right? Oh, I shouldn't have jumped off of that. I thought I was going to need to jump on that platform and then jump over there to get the tooth. But then there are those, like, okay. <laughs> How did I get to talking about this again? Should I stop while I'm ahead of myself? Should I? Is this where I need to end this episode? End my... Restart the episode? No, we'll go on. I know about a lot of these weird fetishes because of... Uh, my group of online friends is amazing. And, you know, sometimes... When you have... A, when you have really cool internet friends who are well-versed in the internet... You you discover weird things at night when you're on Skype together, and that's those are some of the best and most memorable times in your life. So you know there are things that you see that you come across. Uh, I believe there's a oh look now we're crying like tar. That's gorgeous. The one that I was gonna talk about that really weirds me out. I'm sorry if you have this fetish and I'm like shaming you or something. <laughs> it's like diaper fetishes. <laughs> Why are we talking about this? I'm just literally having a conversation with myself in my room about this. It's great. This is stunning. I don't even, I shouldn't even upload this episode at this point. It's fine. It's whatever. Oh, speaking of, there have been actual episodes that I've recorded for this channel where I have, um, I'll be, like, partway through a level, and then I'll just be like, this can't go up on this channel. <laughs> oh, man, Wonderland is really going to shit. 
I think that's only happened like a few times though, where I will, it's, it's, it's not even that I say something like soups in a probes. It's that I just hear it and I'm like, someone is gonna, this is gonna be taken out of context. <laughs> And the internet is just doesn't need to be out there. This is probably one of those episodes I should stop right now, but you know what? It's fine. This is gonna be like a, a sort of episode where it's like behind the scenes what what I what those episodes are like. The awful ones that you never get to hear. It's weird this is only the second episode of this let's play and I'm already talking about fetishes. I've just been like ignoring the game and talking about fetishes. Great. It's just fantastic. Oh shit. Um, okay, let me lure you guys over here first. I want to kill you guys and then I want to kill the wasps. Excuse me, I'm sorry. I'm sorry you're so gross is what I mean. I don't mean I'm sorry that I'm shooting you. I'm just sorry you're disgusting. <laughs> How to apologize to people 101 with Joseph Birdsong. No, can you aim at something else, Alice? Okay, look at- she's so done! Oh, I should probably shift out. <laughs> Did you see her? She just like, threw her hands in the air and was like, Nope, motherfucking nope. <laughs> I guess sometimes it's all you can do. Read this as your life depended on it, because it does. Gather these pearly whites to prevent premature arrival for the pearly gates. Oh! My friends can use the choppers, and you'll improve your weapons. Didn't I already know this? I love how just now it's telling me what the teeth are for. Like, if you've been playing this game, I'm, I'm going to upgrade the Vorpal Blade. Yeah, take take 150 teeth. It's weird that I own 150 teeth, okay? <laughs> like, someone who hasn't played this game before, they're like, Why the fuck am I collecting teeth? For like the past like 30 minutes, first 30 minutes of the game. Okay, so um, let's get some more teeth. <laughs> oh, that's how we got talking about fetishes. Teeth fetish. I wonder if that's a thing. We've circled all the way back around to that, haven't we? Great, gorge, stunning. Welcome to my channel. <laughs> Can we just all agree that diaper fetishes are a little weird? I'm not... It's cool. It's cool if you're into that. It's whatever. It's just whatever. It's just... It's just... It's, it's just... It's just... I'm, that's the last thing I'm gonna say about it. It's... Pretty just. <laughs> Where am I going? Where do I go? Okay. Oh, follow the railroad, I assume. Damn, this place really went to hell. I... Okay, they are seriously all about this earthquake effect right now. Like, every two seconds, the screen is shaking. And it's even while I'm in the air. I don't think that's how air works. I'm pretty sure... Well... Oh, God! Ew! Gross. A little booger. Um... I don't really know how air works. Does air shake? Oh god damn those things. When there's like an earthquake or something? I don't know. I'm not gonna... I'm not gonna pretend like I'm a scientist. Ain't even gonna front it. Ain't even fronting, y'all. Maybe Alice should get like a hair clip or something. Cause that is like... It's always all up on her. In all the cutscenes. That would bother me. Okay. Gorge. Oh, and now everything is teapots. Let's crush some teapots. Instead of snail shells. Shells. Shales. I'm already back in Arkansas and I've already reverted back to my accent. I have been in this... I've been back in Arkansas like literally 24 hours. I've already got the accent back. Okay. Excuse me. Oh, hey! Hey now! You know, you guys aren't supposed to dodge. Okay. Okay, I'm just gonna kill you the good old-fashioned way with a knife. Just... Oh! Whoa! 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 They've got some, like, uh, defenses with their little caps. 
Oh, well, look at him. Okay, Alice can dodge enemy attacks. Oh, that's it? <laughs> so I'm supposed to dodge him and then... And then... Oh, ow! You little booger! I'm just gonna fucking blast your ass. Okay. Alright, you really suck at using that shield. He literally just kept taking his shield down, and that's how I killed him. So good job for him, to him. I love this background music, it's so creepy and fun. It's like... Oh! You just like popped out there, didn't you buddy? Excuse me! Oh, I'm out of Peppa! Sorry! Okay, cute. Oh, more of you. Can I just lure you over here? Hold on, I want to kill the easy ones first. Alright, come on! Come on, cutie! Come on, little gremlin! Mm. Oh! Gotcha! Oh, oh, oh. Oh, oh, I am bad at dodging. <laughs> Let's be real there. Okay, music is gone, so that means everything is safe. I like how that's like a, um... Sort of a standard thing across games, is that when the the battle music comes on, you know there's people around. Battle music goes away, you know your totes okay. That was like a little nursery rhyme I just made. Is I being influenced by Alice in Wonderland? Maybe. Let's see what cuties up here. Oh no, no oh, lord. So guess. They've built these horrible machines and they're controlling them from the inside. I assume that's like foreboding. Oh, okay. Up here. Stunning, stunning, stunning. This game, the initially, lost and don't know where to go. Use a strange sense. Shrink hidden path. So there's secret ledges that you can jump on. That you can only see when you're shrunken. Just like... There's these secret flowers that give you teeth. Hmm. Sometimes... Sometimes... Sometimes teeth. Sometimes teeth. Oh god! I didn't even see you! Nasties. Get you- Oh, that was just my hair I was saying. That- That... Gross dark thing was my hair. <laughs> it's not a slug. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. Homegirl, this hair, though, is flowing amazing. This is like Snape's hair in, uh, Harry Potter. It's like a Lori. This whole thing should have been sponsored by L'Oreal. This whole game. Well, maybe I shouldn't run into the wall. So there are some things, as you can see, when you shrink down, things appear. And this path is only only appears. You can only see it. It's always here. Thank goodness. Uh, but you can only see it with the shrink sense. It could have happened that way. Gorge. You remember poor oh, crazy bird lady memory. She's my fave fave. Didn't he? Oh, uh, what are these goopy goops? How did I completely just forget about them, that they existed? What does it want to show me? <gasps> Is this the Hatter's Domain? Is that where we're at? I don't remember. Good old Hatter. Okay. Let's, uh... Let's deal... Oh! Nope. Deal with this pig snout. Please, Alice. Oh, fuck. Okay. Let's try that again. <laughs> I was aiming right at it, okay. My crosshairs just weren't red. Alright. Let's do this. Stunning. Stunning. Oh, picnic basket. <gasps> Gold teeth! Okay, gorge. Pl wow, they are, like, really loading me up on the teeth. Was that a secret route? Yeah, because I, I actually want to go over there, right? Yeah. Excuse me. I like how she can fall. Like, in Tomb Raider, which you're used to seeing me play, Lara falls, like, a few more blocks than she's supposed to, and she's done. She's dead. Alice can fall in wherever. 
however far, and she's fine. Except, apparently, into the abyss. She can't keep falling forever. Yeah, this is- this is Toad's tea party time! Not the political one. The- the good kind. <laughs> the good kind of tea party that actually involves tea. <laughs> Sorry, that's not a political statement. Whatever. I've already said so many fucking bad things in this episode, it's chill. Whatever. Almost as I, remember it. I guess I'm first person now. Oh, hey! Cutie. What you been munching on? You might want to clean your teeth. Says change is constructive, that different, uh, different is good. Is good. Different denotes neither bad nor good, but it certainly means not the same. Fine. He has cat such cat good quotes. Whoever wrote th the Cheshire's Cat's lines was amazing. Oh shit! Friends, Alice, you're as randomly lethal and entirely confused <laughs> as you ever were. Oh, thank I you. Return to whatever hovels home to you, I'll call if I need I like how she just gets unnecessarily sassy with him. Alice, it's way. Now hold on, and as they say, Oh. Shut up. So typical. Wow. Did we, were we even on a rope or a line at that point? I feel like I just saw the thing just crash into the wall without anything really happening. That's cool, that's chill. <gasps> we got a new outfit! <laughs> Stunning! So we're in the Hatter's Domain now. Um, okay. Some vents need to be activated by turning valves. In an event, you can rotate Alice. Then you jump. So basically, they just... It's just air. Great, I know how air works. Alright! Well, thank you guys for watching. In the next episode, you'll get to see more of the Hatter's Domain and my gorgeous new outfit... That is like totes Victorian-y. Did this one have blood on it? Uh, we'll have to we'll have to see. I guess you could just rewind a few seconds to see. I don't remember already. But yeah, thanks for watching. I'm glad you guys are enjoying this game. Sorry if you have a diaper fetish. <laughs> that was another non-apology. Oh my god, I need to end this episode. Please don't hold any of this against me. Bye guys. Thanks for watching. I love you.